Hello, it's Monday, December 7th. Wow, 2009. I am coming here from a rainy, beautiful California winter day. Who would have thought? And uh, this week we're talking about tracking. Do you track? How do you track your calories, exercise, weight? And what works for you and what doesn't work for you? So I'm sure for a lot of you, last week felt like recovery, trying to figure out how to get back on track from Thanksgiving, and this week it's really time to start um, doing everything right if you haven't already started yet. So this week we're talking about tracking and tracking programs. As you well know, I track on my iPhone using several applications, and since you wouldn't be able to see the little icons if I held them up to the webcam, I'm just going to put in pictures of them in the video. But I use three applications primarily. Um, I track my calories, I track everything that I eat, um, I also track my weight, and I track my exercise, but those are different programs. So just for my calories, I also track my exercise in terms of calories in Lose It as well. So I track my calories and exercise in Lose It, which is the program that we use for Below the Yellow Line as well. That's where you get the weekly image of your calories and how you did according to whatever you've got your line set at, losing weight calories or maintain weight calories. Um, so that's Lose It. The other application I use is um, Weight Bot. WeightBot is a fabulous app. I know you've seen it in my videos before. That's just really cute and quirky and very techy, and it allows you to track your weight. And um, so whenever I do a weigh-in, I enter it into WeightBot, and then there's graphs and charts and different things that show you how your weight has gone over the course of your weight loss. And finally, I use a program called Fitness Plan, which is um, a different way of tracking my exercise. You can categorize your exercises by color, and you can put them in morning, noon, or night for that day so you have a little calendar and it literally shows by color and by distance and time and um, weight or reps or whatever you want to track it as you can um, keep track of every exercise that you do so that's how I track now tracking works for me I like to have a clear record of everything that I'm doing and I like to have it um, always present with me, which is why I put it on my iPhone. I used to have journals. I used to do things like this. Some people have a little star sticker system. Some people track with the calendar on the wall. I mean, there's different methods that work for everybody. For, but for me, one, being a nerd and wanting to see graphs, I love the Lose It application, the Weight Bot application, and the Fitness Plan application because they allow me to graph my progress in every respect. Like in the fitness plan one, if I click on running, it'll show me a graph of the different distances I've done over the entire course of time that I've run. Or, and it'll also show another line on that same graph of the different amounts of time that I ran. So I can see as my time gets longer, as my distances get longer, I can watch that grow. And I love, of course, the, the chart with the yellow line for below the yellow line. Um, tracking works for me because keeping it in my head just doesn't work. Um, first of all, I tend to over or under exaggerate things. Like if I'm just counting calories in my head and I'm rounding up or rounding down, I tend to round down or I tend to forget one thing that I ate, which is 200 calories, which then totally throws off my calories. And all day I thought I was going great with my calories, and then at the end of the day I realize I'm like 300 over it. So I have to have an actual program to track it. And for my exercise, it's the opposite. I tend to. Um, think that I like didn't have nearly as much success with exercising and then I look back at my little thing and I realize oh I did actually exercise most days this week so I tend to I don't know the days seem to stretch out in my brain like one day will seem like four and I'll feel like oh my god I haven't exercised in forever and in truth I exercised the day before yesterday so that's how I do it um, I hope that you find it interesting to see how everybody else this whole week takes care of their calories and I'm sorry, it's getting darker and darker and darker as I'm watching storm clouds roll over the sky. Anyway, we'll have a new weight loss loser soon. In the meantime, there's just six of us, but we all have something to say about how we track, if we track, why it works, why it doesn't, and perhaps um, can give you new ideas and new ways to look at your weight loss.